Before we get into this video, I do want to say minor spoilers for Star Wars The Last Jedi will follow. While the spoilers are not plot breaking ones, the information is highly intriguing. With that said, if you're still here, let's go ahead and begin. Reports are coming from Making Star Wars who is confident Luke is in possession of a secret necklace in The Last Jedi that he carries very closely. The necklace is said to have a red crystal on it and can supposedly clearly be seen several times in the film. The origin of this necklace is that it is likely Vader's very own kyber crystal that Luke may have taken following his duel with him on the second Death Star in Return of the Jedi. Luke likely keeps this token to remember his father, and more specifically, the dark path that he led, attempting never to forget the monster that Darth Vader was, but also that he did not end that way. There were also reports that Luke may possess pieces of Vader's lightsaber itself, but that it is not assembled, rather only little sections can be pointed out. Again, I want to make it clear that I do not believe this is a major plot point of the film, simply some intriguing lore building stuff that fans can fanboy over. If it does end up being a plot point however, on making Star Wars, they theorize that Kylo may be after this necklace, and it could be interesting to see him claim it and place it within either his crossguard lightsaber or a new lightsaber in order to obtain a stable weapon, and also one linked to Vader, as we know the explanation for Kylo's unstable blade is that it contains a cracked crystal. Overall, I love this idea, and I absolutely think it's something Luke would do. An interesting thing to point out, however, is in Star Wars Aftermath, a group calling themselves the Acolytes of the Beyond, which we now know eventually become the Knights of Ren, purchase what they think is Vader's lightsaber, with intentions of destroying it. However, the book does go out of its way to make a point that it may not be Vader's lightsaber. It is still something worth discussing, though. But now I would love to hear what you guys have to say concerning Luke and keeping his father's lightsaber crystal. Like I said, I think it's a fabulous idea, and part of me does it want it to play a major role, just a hugely exciting piece of the mythos that in my opinion fits perfectly. Luke keeping the kyber crystal tells us a lot about him, and stylistically sounds perfect for Luke's overall design. A scene where Rey asks Luke about the necklace would also be intriguing to see. I do want to say I think Luke is in possession of this more because it was his father's, and that is the connection he has with it, rather than it perhaps being a sign of a darker Luke that some have suggested it being. If we look back to the Jedi of old, they did actually keep Sith artifacts, as they believed they were best protected by the Jedi themselves, this could also be an interesting dynamic to have in The Last Jedi. It also leads into the obvious question, what else does Luke have? And although there are multiple theories as to how Kylo acquired Vader's helmet, is it possible he stole it from Luke himself? All intriguing thoughts. If you have any topics you would like to see made into full length videos, please leave them in the comments down below, as I do read them all. If you enjoyed this video, and feel it deserves it, I would really appreciate it if you could leave a like, as it helps the channel out a great deal. If you would like to contact me directly, the best place to do so is on Twitter, at StupendousWave. If you haven't already, maybe consider subscribing to ensure you stay up to date with everything Star Wars related, from news, theories, and explanation videos. Thanks again for watching, may the Force be with you, and have a great day.